Hey guys, what's going on? It's Nock. Welcome along to a brand new video. You'll notice there's a brand new angle, just trying something a little bit different. Let me know what you think in the comments. But we are here to continue playing through the Minimalist series, and this is Minimalist 6 by Henham. If you're new to the channel, please like and subscribe. Without further ado, let's jump into the description. Uh, no elements, a map that while lacking difficulty makes for makes for up for with some decent into hell imagery. Okay, and um, I don't know, I was thinking back, as it's a day's past since I did like the first half of this collection, I was kind of thinking back and um, I hope that I kind of didn't um, sound too underwhelmed with what I did yesterday uh, in the uh, 1 to 5 maps because at the end of the day, the collection has no elements, it's just portal surfaces, so there is only like so much you can do, so... Um, I mean, I haven't watched the footage back, but I, I, I just didn't want anybody to think that maybe I was sounding a little bit sort of underwhelmed with the whole thing. But anyway, let's uh, jump into here, shall we? And, okay, it's probably... Return path, maybe? So I was thinking about doing something like jumping through... Something like this, but the yeah the the movement is quite finicky. I don't want to drop in. I just want to do it. From, well, far too much. I just want to do it from kind of like the. It's hard to describe. I know what I mean. I know what I'm trying to say in my head. I just can't get the words out. So um yeah, it's kind of what I wanted to do. But I think yeah. All right. So let's check out what's over here. Yeah, all right. So. Oh wow, uh, I think that was right. <laughs> Jeez, that was a bit... Um... Uh, okay, I think I, I just kind of fired balls. <laughs> like, hope for the best there. And there, there we go. Kind of cheesed it, so I apologise for that. Like I said, I just kind of fired portals and, and things happened. So, um, all right, let's move on to number seven, shall we? Did I just say number six? If I said number six, I meant number seven. Because this is middle list number seven. Uh, puzzle concerning momentum, visibility, and the torturous process needed to obtain both momentum and visibility, it seems. All right, so let's press on. Okay, well, that's not going to get us up there, that's for sure. All right, seems as good a start as any. Be return. Okay, so we can go up fire portal. Ha ha ha. Didn't mean to do that. Didn't mean to do that. Jeez. It's rather bright down there, isn't it? Right, let's try this again. And that's going to be orange portal. Okay. Okay. Then I think we're going to do this, this. Okay. 
Okay. Um, but... Enough, but then I can do this. That's clever. Okay. Alright, cool. That was, that was pretty clever. I was kind of struggling how to see I get that extra momentum, but yeah. Jumping back to the original block. Let's move on to the next. Alright, so this is the minimalist number eight, and the description is a puzzle that takes an old technique to a new and strange place. Looks cool too. Alright. A new and strange place. An old technique. So that's not it. It's got there. So why why didn't that work? I think because I was being a flid. That is my expert opinion on the matter. Uh oh. Alright, let's do this again. So that's that, that's that. Then we're gonna do this get onto here. Uh huh. Um, maybe I should have kept the wall pole again. Alright, let's um, start this again. Alright, so, through here. But I can't keep the wall pole, can I? Don't know. I could do something like that, but I mean, I'm not sure. It's a bit timey. Because I only have to do that. I then also have to. Shit. Alright. Let's go up here. But this is different to what I had before, right? So then I could do... Then I could do... The obvious thing would be... Do this.
Uh, I want to go on the other side. So I lose all my momentum. Okay, so I'd want to do this over here. Hold on, could I do... Just get me there. Then I can do... this to get me over here and then finally this to give me that final bit of momentum I actually like that one that one's pretty pretty clever I, I like that that little twist on uh, the portal momentuming um, a lot of people use that in maps but um, yeah nice to see like you said in the description nice twist on it so uh, yeah let's go on to number nine Okay, so this is number nine, um, a short but difficult map requiring complex vertical thinking. Now, I think this is the one which Mr. Vapor Waterhandle said to play his map before this one. So, let's see how we get on here, shall we? So obviously the aim of the game now would be to store the momentum in the ceiling. momentum do I need? Four. Yeah. Makes sense. Makes sense. do is this maybe one two three one two three four five I jump off there into there I go through the ceiling come back through here with enough to get onto there yeah that's what I need to do I just need to juggle myself across because I'm going to have to use this floor portal, right? So, yeah. Alright. Oop. That was wrong. Camera is wrong. One more, just to be safe. Okay. Yep, see that there. So now. I can do this. Get 
totally the wrong way. Oh, <laughs> oh dear. Well, that was a fail. Let's try again. My problem there, I got totally turned around coming out the portals. And I wasn't sure which side I needed to be on to um, get to the, the wall. Save there this time. Alright, so. There we go. We got it. We got it, guys. We're good. Let me just go to the exit. Woohoo! Alright. Cool stuff. I like that. That's a. Uh, um, again, pretty straightforward, but if you're not used to sort of doing those sorts of maps, it um, could be a challenge. But let's go on to the final map in the Minimalist Collection. Alright, so we're on to the final map of the collection. This is the Minimalist 10. Uh, a difficult, con convoluted, oh dear, unforgiving map that should not be attempted by anyone, at least not without doing number nine first. All right. What have we got here then? Um, okay. on the top here. Um, I would only assume we do this. Out to this platform here. Uh huh. And then I'm wondering. Where does this lead? I was wondering if done. Why I did it, nobody knows, but hey. So I'm going to go up to there, right? So what I'm thinking is, jump down to here. And I fluffed it. Alright, let's try all that again. Where the unforgiving part comes in, I guess. Then we went to here. And of course, I didn't jump off the edge, so I don't have enough momentum. 
Let's imagine I did jump off the edge like this. Alright, and then I did this around to here. Didn't I? That's what I did. Oh, that wasn't what I did. That wasn't what I did before. Oh dear. That, I had that. I walked around there and put a portal on. Do that, come back round. Then gain of momentum, possibly. Okay, so. Let's put that there. Back up to here. Then I go back round to here. Up through the ceiling. Down to here, possibly. And what I wanted to do. So I've got enough to go to there, but does that give me anything different to what I had before? Feel not. With seven. One, two, three. That gives me enough, but. Gives me enough, but not enough to then. So I need to do that but higher up. All of a sudden I feel so unprepared or underprepared for this. This is, um, the description did say it all. It was long, it was convoluted. So, one, two, three, four, four, Look up here. I know I'll probably have to redo like everything I've done so far again, but it's a five.
Yeah, if I'd have... If I'd have thought about that a little bit better. So, on. So, I... Let's think. Yeah, I did that, right? Just trying to re reverse a little bit. That's there. This to here. So, I want to go to the left. Oh, I did the wrong pole. Well, pole management has never been one of my strong points. I'm just seeing firsthand today exactly why that is. Can I then go over here? Through to here. It'll just take me. Not to where I wanted to go. It's alright, I'll do that. Okay. So. I just had a thought. I... I'm not just sure I know where I'm actually going here. But yeah, we're, we're in that unforgiving stage again now. So, I'm going to quickly backwards, 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 backwards. There, that's what we had, wasn't it? So we had this state valid before. I've just come to realize that I've not actually looked to see where the exit is. That would probably help, right? I knew where the exit was. Um, Then you can't hit it. It's it's really frustrating. I would have thought like jumping would have had that much effect on it. I call BS. Oh, come on. It's the air strafing technique. That would have worked. Would have worked. If only I'd have finished that Death Wish 8 map that was like the air strafing technique that I gave up on years ago. Oh, 
Oh, come on, I can make this. I can make this. I know I can make this. Maybe if I pull some more faces, I can make. <laughs> oh dear. Concentration faces, I can feel them, they're coming out. I can feel them. That, that's BS. That's grade A BS right there. I should have made that. There we go. Jeez. Okay. I'm actually going to save that. I don't know if that's helpful or not, but I'm going to save. Because I feel like it's, um... I, I done did a good thing. So. What was I going to do from here? Yeah, I wanted to go and get the ceiling portal. Onto here. Which I can then use to get up to here. Clearly my confidence is like... Brimming with stuff. Um, let's see, that's the problem. I, I Generally, I don't know where the exit is. I haven't looked to see where the exit is at this point, so I'm going to save. And I'm guessing it's up high somewhere. Oh, exit's there. How on earth did I get to here? Oh, I never went through there. What an absolute tit. Alright. I know where the exit is now. That's, that's positive, right? I know where the exit is. Ah. <sighs> So what if I now do this? Okay. Do that, do that, but couldn't I then do move again. <laughs> this move again. If I could, if I can pull this off again. There we go. 
I'm not convinced that's that's intended because if I now try and put that all together, we come up with something that doesn't use half the map. Alright, so I went that. Go to there. This to get up to here. Bloop. This to go up to here. Bloop. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then we just like do this move again. So yeah, um I actually think I managed to break a no elements map. Albeit that this move is comically tricky and it's taken us the best part of thirty attempts to pull it off, but yeah. Um I've been at it for like twenty minutes I see. And I should probably call it a day. Once I can do this again. I don't have time for the refire my pole. Damn it. So I need that precise. It's, it is a bit too precise, I know. There we go. That's got it. Uh, so yeah, I'm gonna leave it there. But God, that that map was uh, the last one was definitely a puzzle um, and a challenge. And um, to be fair, I'm not really sure how you would go about solving that properly. Um, so yeah, I'd be interested to see in the comments uh, if you be so kind or anybody can link me to a walkthrough as to how that is done. But um, no, overall, I enjoyed the collection. Um, a nice set of maps. Thank you very much for making and thank you very much to Mr. Vapor Water Handle for pointing me in the right direction of these maps. But guys, thank you very much for watching. As always, like, comment, subscribe down below. If you've got any more slides to play, please leave them in the comments or head over to my Google form. I'll link that's in the description. But until next time, I've been Ock. You've been awesome. See ya.